hey collective welcome back guys so let's go ahead and see what is your message for today what is coming towards my collective today universe archangel spirit angel guides and guardians collective please don't forget to like share subscribe click that notification bell it allows me to connect with you energetically and it definitely helps me out with the growth of the channel as you all know these readings are timeless general love readings so they may or may not resonate with you please take what does and leave the rest behind as you know time is fluid so whenever you find this reading you are meant to hear it and there is no gender in tarot reverse the roles as needed so let's go ahead and see what is your overall message for today what's coming towards you today what does my collective need to prepare for universe archangels spirit angel guides and guardians what is the overall message here so i have ego minds pride vanity status quo but this is six of wands energies though i feel like there is a lot of victory and success that's getting ready to come towards you but do be careful with people that are around you that may not be happy for you they may f smile in your face and act like everything is going to be fine and dandy you're gonna be good but the truth of the matter i just heard you need to watch your back okay you have people around you that are not going to be happy for the new blessings that are coming into your life okay people around you are jealous of you they act like your friend one minute but they turn around in two seconds and they start talking crap about you right away um this may have to do with a relationship to be very honest with you okay now for some of you guys i heard that there's someone from your past coming back and the people around you don't like this person okay um or it just may be somebody completely new coming into your life and they're going to be jealous of this relationship of yours whatever the situation may be for you look at the card that wanted to come out apology and forgiveness i do feel like people around you are not going to be okay with this partner of yours but at the end of the day you're the one that's got to sleep with them who cares what every, anyone else thinks about your relationship um i do feel like people have their very own opinions in regards to what you do but again you're the one that does your thing you don't have to respond to no one but yourself and your creator so i do have this mars in hot so this is a very passionate connection. I do got to be very honest with you. I feel like someone is rushing in here. Um, they're wanting to take some action with you. And I don't know why. I do got to be honest with you guys. I feel like this is someone from your past. Someone who screwed things up with you. Um, where your friends were like, no, no, don't give this person a second chance. Is coming back towards you. Okay. Because they do have a lot of regrets. Okay. Someone here has a lot of regrets because the way they acted in the past. The way they, they made you suffer. Um, the way they held themselves back without being clear as to what their intentions were or why did they decide to just up and go. Um, they're coming towards you to express a truth, okay? I just heard the whole truth and nothing but the truth. So whomever it is that you were dealing with in the most recent past, and this is like your, your, your last ex, okay? The one person that you would ultimately reconsider giving another opportunity is coming back towards you, okay? There is a conversation that this person wants to have with you. It is clear communication and it's finally honesty in regards to this connection. I do feel like this person is going to open up emotionally and explain to you why they had to walk away from you for some of you guys it had to do with debt it had to do with other contracts it had to do with some karmic cycles they had to learn some lessons before they can come completely to this connection okay um i do feel like for a lot of you guys this is definitely going to resonate because you gave a person the opportunity to get to know you and you get to know them and they burned that bridge with you now they're wanting to come back and give this relationship a, a, another chance but you're in a place where you know what i already gave you my time i already gave you my energy i don't i can't see myself doing this once again so this person will be having a difficult time to get you back look it six of cups energy nostalgia this person's coming back because they're missing you because they can't stop thinking about you they definitely want to reunite with you they do want a reconciliation here but they also know that it's going to be an obstacle it's going to be a problem it isn't going to be as easy as they thought it was going to be because the way they walked away from you in the past without giving you any form of clarity or honesty is what really burned that bridge with you now for some of you guys i just heard once you get on my shit list that's it it's a done deal so i feel like this person place their own self on your shit list but they're going to attempt to get their self off it 
with the 5d here dream messages now this is very clear that you're going to be getting communication from this person whom the truth of the matter collective i feel like you may think a lot about or you may even have dreams about this person or you've been having dreams about you and someone reuniting well that's just universe giving you a bonus as to what's going to get ready to come towards you your spirit guides are giving you signs that someone is getting ready to come towards you and revive a connection here um they've been far away from you with distance here they've literally physically blocked themselves from this connection maybe even emotionally closed themselves out i do feel like the tables are turning here and this may ultimately end up being your energy at the moment because now you find yourself emotionally disconnected from this situation see this person had the opportunity to have a beautiful connection with you to have a very abundant relationship here with you but because they chose to go the different path because they chose to follow someone else or something else they ended up screwing themselves over in this connection so now the tables have turned now you're the one that has full control of the situation and now they're going to be at your knees they're going to be begging you for forgiveness they're going to want to be with you and you are going to have to be the one that's gonna have to absolutely make that final decision someone here has been repeatedly coming into your thoughts you very well know who this is i i feel like i don't have to really reiterate that as much i do feel like for some of you guys you've been you've been having this person's energy around you very heavily they've also been thinking about you very heavily you see a lot of cars um you see their car all over the place, excuse me. You might even hear their voice or you see their name. Or every time you hear a tarot reading, they're telling you about this specific ex. It's because this individual is thinking about you. This person is thinking about a way of coming towards you and trying to resolve this situation. They walked away because they had to heal some inner child trauma. They, need to, they needed to fix some wounds here. They needed to learn some type of lessons. I feel like this individual has learned those lessons. In this separation, this person is longing for you. Um, they know that they abandoned you. They know that they broke your heart and they caused you a lot of grief. But now, like I stated previously, now they're starting to feel what you felt at one point. And this is why they're trying to come back towards you. With springtime, as you all know, what was it? A couple days ago, we officially went into summer here in the United States. I feel like this is an energy that has been growing and will be full blown. I don't know why I heard Leo season. I'm getting very strong Leo season here. But there is an opportunity here for a lot of growth in this connection. This, these are seeds that were planted previously and now are growing in, at this time. The past is coming back. The past is suffering without you. The past can't find their way in this world without you. This is why this individual is trying to make their way towards you as soon as possible. I do got to be very honest with you guys. I feel that by the time autumn hits, right after summer, you and this individual are going to start over again. There is an opportunity for this relationship to be revived. It's time for you and this person to move towards a more abundant happy energy now they do have to prove themselves they're not gonna have it easy to come in this person is not just gonna walk in and be like oh okay you're back let's go ahead and pick up where we left off at no it's not gonna work like that this person is going to have to prove themselves above and beyond for you or towards you to show you that here they're here for the long run that they're not just here to run off external party here and the loss i do feel like this person if they had any type of third party interference in this connection that third party is no longer in the connection now guys please keep in mind that third parties don't necessarily have to be a sexual connection they can definitely be friends and family members interfering in this but whomever or whatever was interfering in this connection it has been rejected it has been completely removed and it, removed and it has been left out in the cold What's coming towards you, final message, is abundant and windfall, okay? So at the end of the day, guys, if you do choose to take this opportunity with this person, just understand that take it slow. You're the only one that can ultimately make the final decisions in this relationship. But the truth of the matter, you're going to have many, many reasons of celebration with this individual. I do feel like this is going to be a very successful relationship the second time around. I just heard the third. I don't know how many times you guys have separated with this person. But I feel like this time, around, this time is going to be the last time and it's going to be a very successful reunion. What are the final messages here for my collective? What advice do we have here, universe? So very soon, guys prepare yourself someone has made a clear decision to come towards you they know what they want and they want you 
they're hoping and praying that you can trust them once again i feel like they are going to fight for your trust but you are being told by your ancestor your spirit guys to trust this situation it is calling for you to have faith and the bottom of the deck can be made any more clearer than this guys give your relationship a chance okay work on this partnership i do feel like this relationship has the opportunity to be revived to be mended once again and to be able to move forward you and this person had to come to this temporary separation because both of you guys had to deal with personal things i feel like this person had to close other cycles out and now that they're coming towards you they will be asking you for another opportunity and this time around i do see this person doing whatever it takes to win you back Okay. All right, guys. I hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if anyone is interested in a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care.